It truly breaks my heart to see that most men today have just given up on themselves. That most guys really think that all they've been able to achieve so far is the ceiling of their potential. Listen, you were so far from the truth because if you don't have your dream car, your dream house, your dream woman, the dream bank account that you want, having as much money as you've always wanted, trust me, it's truly possible for you to get all these things. The crazy thing is, they never teach us how to do this in school. Why do you think that is? It's because they want to keep you poor because not everyone can win. So I truly hope you listen to this because at the start of this year, I was able to learn a couple things and this has changed my life around. I was able to learn about the idea of how you can truly get anything that you want. And just give me some time if you pay attention to this. I'm so sure that this will not, Bro, this video will change the way you view yourself and your life and stuff. Trust me. Listen, at the start of this this year, 2024, three months prior to that point, I had left my nine to five job and everything. And as you can imagine, I was broke. I wasn't receiving any salary for like maybe four, four months or so. The crazy thing for me was at the start of the year, I was down in Nigeria and I, was, I remember writing down my um, New Year's resolution. And on there somewhere was about like making money and stuff. And man, if I told you back then that I knew an idea of how I was going to make money, I'm a flipping liar. I didn't know how it was going to happen. I just knew that, listen, I'm just going to make it work somehow. I left Nigeria in January. By February, um, it was getting to me, man. There was still no money coming into my bank account. And I was like, you know what, bun this. I'm going to have to get a, a job. Listen. I applied for a job at Wingstop. I got the job at Wingstop. I had been given everything I needed. I just had to come in for and basically start my shift. But right before that happened, I reached out to this guy I know and I asked him to just help me out with my fitness coaching stuff. Bro. Two weeks from the point where this guy helped me, I made around like somewhere around like five thousand dollars somewhere something around that and my eyes went like like what the hell was this because prior to that point i had made nothing the most amount of money i've ever i've ever made in a month during that period was probably around like two thousand to two two thousand pounds i say something around that so for me making five thousand in two weeks was like what the hell like how did this flipping happen one thing that happened was i believed listen the only way you can truly get anything that you want is in here your mind controls everything before i got on that call with that guy yeah i truly believed that this guy was going to change my life and that conversation was going to change my life and i tell you this like i swear my mom's life bro like when i got off that call I told myself that bro, four weeks from now, my life is going to be completely different. I just had that belief. I was so confused. I didn't know how it happened, but I was like, oh, man, like I just knew that this is gonna change my life and stuff. And from there, I started to pay attention to like, I, so when that happened, I was like, listen, I need to recreate this. Like, obviously like I did actually like within the next four weeks, my life changed. So I was like, hold on, like how did this happen? I started to pay attention to what happened before, how I can start to shape my mind and stuff. And brother, the growth ever since has just been crazy, man. Like making thousands and thousands of dollars since after leaving my nine to five job till now. And just being in a position where like, I know for a fact that I don't need a nine to five job ever again. That in itself is just like crazy to me. And listen, if you want to create a success for yourself, I'm going to tell you this. You must master this, what's in here, what's in your mind. Because if you don't, brother, <laughs> just end the video right now. You are never going to get this done. Listen, the first thing you have to do, you have to be very clear about your goals. But before we talk about your goals and stuff, I'll tell you how powerful your mind is. If I told you right now, like, bro, just shut your eyes and don't think about an ego. Shut your eyes and do it. Most of you guys are still gonna think about an ego. You wanna know why? Because your mind doesn't know what is true or false. Your mind doesn't know what is fake or not. Your mind only knows what you pay attention to. So when you pay attention to certain things, those are the things you start to see. Have you ever been in a position where maybe your parents got a new car, maybe you got a new pair of shoes and stuff, and all of a sudden, 
you start to see that everywhere and anywhere you go it's because you start to pay attention to that and it's it's the same with who you are right now and your goals because if you're in a position right now that you don't like all that's been happening this entire time is you've been paying attention to the fact that I don't want a mediocre life or maybe I'm okay with being a mediocre being mediocre in my life and stuff and that's exactly what you've been attracting this whole time listen the secret to just your success is you have to be very clear about the goals that you want for your for in your own life brother listen a lot of guys say to themselves like I want to be successful I want to have this I want to have that but those that success means nothing to you because there is no way you can quantify that so in your head maybe you're successful right now because if there is no way you can describe something then you don't really know about that thing or you don't really want that thing because if I told you if someone told me now what does success mean to you like right now I can clearly say it so right now my advice to you is make a long list of the goals that you want maybe take a page out right now and just write down everything that you truly want from life like what does it mean for you to be truly successful in your own life once you can start to do this reduce that list so i said like maybe three or five three or five bullet points and then you have what your what success truly means for you because that's the first step to achieving everything that you want second doubt on your journey to becoming that ultimate version of yourself you're going to think to yourself like is this truly possible <coughs> i know this is where the magic happens yeah doubt if you let that creep into your mind that will steal everything from you because everything in this life is simply just energy that's a fact listen the people who are at a certain point in life where you want to be they're literally on a certain vibration they're a lot higher than you are and all that negative energy would only bring you down doubt and failure and all that all those similar traits and stuff you want to remove that from your mind as soon as possible and so some of you might be thinking like how can i remove doubts from myself like i don't really control it you control your mind listen because that's the only thing that you can control and every time doubt comes doubts will always come and trust me regardless of who you are you will always get the doubt but one thing you can do to shift that to remove that doubt from your mind is just you have to reframe the question so if for example i'm thinking to myself like man like i haven't been able to sign any client today as a fitness coach like oh, maybe my business is dying if i'm if that thought is starting going to your head like oh maybe you're actually going to fail maybe you're going to have to go back to your job the reframe would be okay cool how can i get new clients and stuff how can i do this how can i focus on the positive of this situation like okay cool like i've been working with these many clients like how can i improve their work and maybe something else can happen so they can um um in the future refer their friends to me and stuff just shifting the way you think about certain things can allow you to start to view things in a very very different way like it doesn't matter how you frame it that frame always has to be positive and that shifts that doubt from your mind because if you dwell on the things about like oh maybe what if it doesn't work and what if this bro if you start to think about that it will never work it will never flip and work because whatever you focus on is exactly what you have i'm going to tell you guys this here this year the thoughts that you think control your actions and your actions control your behavior and behavior controls who you are today if you don't have the behaviors that you like it have if you don't have if you don't have the behaviors that you like right now it's simply because your thoughts are aligned with something else and now you're just wishing and wanting that something will happen and that thing will never happen because you have to fix your thoughts first your thoughts is the mother of everything that's where everything originates that bro that that is the first thing that you have to that's the that's another thing you have to fix your thoughts and never let doubt creep into your mind doubt will always creep but once you find it there you must take it out from the flipping roots second your environment listen if you're not willing to control your environment if you're not willing to move yourself from an environment that stops you from becoming the true version of yourself I hate to bring it to you brother maybe success is not just for you why do you think i moved down to the us I was I used to live in the UK, but I knew that if I wanted to really achieve the success that I said I wanted, my environment was going to decide how hard I work because here's the thing. Your environment will always trigger certain behaviors, and if you really want success and you really want to start to think in a different way, you must be around people that inspire you to be better. 
I hate to say this, but most of the friends I had at back in London were all nine to five workers and stuff. And I have nothing with, no problem with that. The only thing is, that's not what I wanted for myself. So I had to put myself in an environment where I can get inspired to do the same. Because trust me, like everything is all about energy and vibration. Trust me, like people who are at a certain vibration who like, like they all think the same, they always stay the same. You know what they say, like, like minds move alike and stuff like all bears of the same feather flocked flock together if you want to start to act a different way you must remove yourself from the environment that you're in that forces you to act in a certain way if you don't do that brother like trust me you will never get there extraordinary things will only happen to the mind that is willing to accept, accept those things you must have faith in the fact that you can achieve everything that you want and that faith has to be unwavering and everything comes with practice like me i'm talking to you right now about this like bro before i got to this point where like i truly believe like listen no one could tell me anything i know that everything i want i'm going to get it like my belief right now is crazy because i've been able to do this work on this belief over and over and on and over and over again because i told myself that listen if the only thing i can control is my mindset i'm going to make sure my mindset is going to be the one thing that is so formidable that i'm do i don't have to see the success now but i know for a fact that it will come and here's the thing the small wins the small things you start to do start to create that success for yourself like it's crazy to me how like that five thousand dollars i spoke about almost came out of thin air it was almost like like how did this come it came because of my mindset and my belief i believed that this guy was going to change my life and that's exactly what happened and even that point throughout my journey when i stopped believing and stuff exact same thing happened nothing was coming in it's so <laughs> it's so incredible how your mindset would always determine your success so please i urge you today don't settle for less start to shift the way you think about your life start to shift the way you think about your success and your success will come to you and this is a promise man don't accept mediocrity don't accept comfort Push the boundaries, remove yourself, remove yourself from, from an environment that will slow you down because trust me, putting yourself or surrounding yourself with people that don't encourage you or people that think that what the things you're about to do are silly, that's like you trying to be in the middle of an ocean with two cinder blocks down your leg. That's only going to have you drowning, man. Trust me, everything that you want is truly attainable. I can promise you guys right now. Like, I wish I could make you guys see what's going on in my mind and how my life has changed from January 2024 to December 2024 just so you guys can make a start on your own journey. So don't expect everything to be perfect at the start. Make a flipping start. But just believe. Believe that you're going to achieve it and trust me, you will. It's a pleasure having you guys on the call today, man. I keep saying call. <laughs> It's a pleasure having you guys on the video today, man. If you're new here, subscribe, like the video. And yeah, join my free school community. I talk more about like fitness on there. But yeah, I got a couple of things coming for you guys, man. Trust me, like I love, I have a couple of things I'm cooking. I feel like you guys would absolutely love. So lock in, get to work, start to do the things I, start, I, I said throughout this video. Even if you picked one thing, like I said, the goal for this channel is to inspire millions of people to improve their lives in some way. And I know for a fact we're going to get there. I love you all. If you keep watching and keep showing love and support, man, I love you guys. Like literally, like this is crazy, but I do actually love you all. And like I keep saying, man, get to work.